Over the past decade, while commercial aviation safety continues on a long-term improving trend, the fatal accident rate for general aviation overall has remained flat, and for personal flying has jumped about 25%. Every year, the NTSB continues to investigate about 1,400 accidents that kill more than 400 people. And not only are pilots dying, but all too often family members, friends, and business associates traveling with them lose their lives as well. The National Transportation Safety Board, an independent federal agency, investigates accidents and makes recommendations to make travel safer for everyone. Each year, we issue our most wanted list of critical actions needed to reduce transportation accidents and save lives. Improving general aviation safety is on that list for the second consecutive year. In our general aviation accident investigations, we see similar circumstances time after time. In many cases, pilots did not have the sufficient knowledge, skills, or recurrent training to fly safely. As part of the solution, earlier this year, we issued five safety alerts to highlight the most common types of accidents that occur in general aviation so that both pilots and mechanics can benefit from the lessons that have been learned from these tragic events. The safety alerts, which are available on our website, include risk management and decision-making, maintenance issues for both pilots and mechanics, inadvertent flight into low visibility conditions, and low altitude stalls and loss of control. It will take everyone in the general aviation community, especially pilots, flight instructors, and mechanics, doing their part to make both personal and business-related general aviation flying safer for everyone.